Alright guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Today I have something very, very special for you. It's that special that it gets the full camera treatment. It gets the edited treatment. Because it's not every day we get a map from Rogan. And we have got one. It's called the Chimel Chimeling-ing. It's from Rogan. And it promises to be very, very special. It's, it, it promises to be something we've never experienced before. It just... Believe me, I, I've heard such good things about this. Now, I've been told the description plays a big part in this map, so uh, we need to respect the description. Um, but anyway, let's jump right in, and we'll see where we go. The Chameleon of Kill. Welcome to my scary story. Today, we will be exploring the depths. <laughs> exploring depth. I think we're going to see a lot of spelling mistakes in this. Um, of Condemned Aperture. Whenever you meet with a number symbol like this, Please read the corresponding text. The game series adapts to the choices you make. The series is tailored by how you play. Oh my goodness, this sounds amazing, Roman. Viewer discretion is advised, but don't worry, it's not real. Except for the part that is. Alright, before the story. Before story starts, pre-story. One day, one after daytime, Chamel was taking a brisk stroll through the corridors of Apsha. Chamel was wearing an all orange, but not on the top. It was a white top. The boots are brisk white too. Suddenly, she took a brisk walk in a different direction to find Do Or. You know, I, I get the feeling she likes to move briskly on this. Him walked, and the elevator was there. Now it is going to be going to the condemned chambers, but the sign read, "Warning: Very spooky ahead. Do not go in." Chamel did not see the sign and was very bad thing to miss. She waited in the elevator. Is that Darth Vader's sister? As brisk wind blew, it made the elevator shaft very not good feeling. Schmel wanted to go home. It was scary and spooky, but also scary. As the elevator sank lower into the dark parts of Apsha, him heard the sounds of a scream. The scream sounded human, condu confusing, but also scary and scary. As him kept going down deeper and deeper and deeper, and also deep, the elevator stopped working, but then it worked again after a brisk moment, and then it kept going down. After a long, long, long brisk wait, Chamel had arrived at it, the con condemned cha chamber. The screens were pitch black in the elevator room, and there was a mm, brisk silence in the air. Deaf and at at must deaf and. At my circle for a creamy pasta. Briskly, Chanel took five walk around, five walk for forward, and then froze in her fear. Then the scream was loud, now and more brisk. Him run back to the elevator, but it was locked. This was not great. In fact, it was not a good thing. With no other choice, she went on the, on the down on the down staircase. Oh yeah, I forgot to say, Chamel has two arms at this point. Continue. Right, interesting to know that uh, we have two arms. Um, I can run back to the elevator though. I I've picked a hole in your story, but may I just say, Rogan, your storytelling is fantastic. Right, anyway. Uh, why is the door red? Okay, we found a number one. I think we get now get to read some more. Okay. One. After go down staircase, the door opens. But as it opened, it turned red, like the vet of blood. Scary Chamel is met with a danker than usual test chamber entrance. Also, everything is bathed briskly red. Something was not right. In fact, something wasn't right. Rightened. Chamel carried forward, entering the room, floor briskly lit red. Seamel Here's a familiar voice. Glamdus. Glamdus was thought to be dead, but was actually alive. Now this is twist. Glasm spoke words. Gladys commenced start standing by in three, two, one. What could this mean? Clem thought to him themselves. No idea of what this meant. Cam to Cam to Ch Chmel Seamel's head, Melon. Sorry, I've just, I'm, I'm clearly not. Um, educated enough to read this 
level of um, English literature. It's just fantastic. It's way above my intelligence. Carry on I must, Seamel thought aloud to himself. Unfortunately, Chamel seemed to be briskly trapped. Worry not, Seamel is not stuck, but looks stuck. Chem waits patiently for some Chang. Okay, Chamel still has all limbs, including two both arms at this point in time. PSP, continue. All right, it's good, it's good to know we've still got all our, our, our body parts. I'm a little bit worried, though, that we're going to be disemboweled at some point. Also, I didn't realize that um, Chamel's quite powerful because they have the ability to change their sexuality, it seems. Okay, so we're in a room. Oh my god, is that a portal gun? I think it is. Let's get some portal gun. Chanel. I've been trolled. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, it's an exit. Are we done, Rogan, already? And if I was thinking anything bad of you... <laughs> Ow, are my ears. Holy crap. I hope there's something in the story about... Um, we was worried about losing body parts. Um, I hope uh, Chanel's ears are fine after that one. Exit this way. Where did that come from? Uh, okay. Man, R R Rogan's got all, all the mod cons in this one. He's, he's using world, world portals. I thought this was like standard beam on for a bit, but... Um, oh my god, now we're levitating. Goodness. Uh, oh, Walter. Uh, okay. Now, let's go. Ah, sorry. Alright, we made the story too. I was just about to say, I'm, I was worried that I'd maybe missed uh, an, a crucial point of the story here, but. Uh, all right, we can move on to number two here. A do or open. The wall reveal more, allowing smell to continue. Chamel sees some of the dist. A gun, Chamel excreted. She excreted it? Really? Oh my goodness, this this writing. I forgot to mention, Hell lost portal, portal a gun when spook happened time ago. Chamel briskly moves forward at the pace of, but else... The gun was not real. It died a very long time time ago. This spooked Chamel, but then a bacon of red light, <laughs> bacon of red light, <laughs> that of of blood appeared behind him. Briskly mobbing mob towards it, Chamel spots more room to the right or left. The exit. Surely this was real. An ali a lie. Alvi. Alive, Alvi. I don't know. <laughs> I just it's that that word's above my intelligence. Um, no way this could be fall. Zero percent chance of brisk failure. Jamel scoot towards exit, but trap. The floor fall beneath him. Surely this was work of Gl Glamdus, known evil doer, and good baker, or possibly the production of ghosts. Seamel follows a, a corridor, and many things happen. Jamel fall into first room. But, this time, on ceiling, and also float. Crazy, but Chamel noticed portal open. Chamel go through and is meet with infinite portal. Chamel screams, but cannot, but can it scream, cause, cause. Chamel fly by some turrets, scare, and land in room. Chamel fright, but also think, this can't be real, too scary. Remember? That Seamel still has all limbs. All right. Doesn't say anything about the ears. About being deaf. Okay. Where do we go from here? Where do we go? Where do we go? I heard a door open. Okay, it's the exit. We're saved. Rogan's gonna let us get to the exit. Clearly. Not. We're not going back to the world's exit. How many exits are there in this place? Like, seriously. Um, I believe I'm being pushed. I'm going to fall into the 
Ah, du Deutschmann. Yes. Oh my goodness. I really hope um, Rogan is ready for some lawsuits. When I am deaf. Man, that's uh, certainly scared the bejesus out of Ow! Alright, thanks, it's down here. Obviously. Rogan wouldn't lie to us. Alright, point three! Uh, okay. Again, Chamel seemed to be tarped. But door wall open, revealing another door wall. No way but frontwards. Seamel ca carry briskly on, but another floor trap. Surely this thing behind this knew this was unoriginal, as this hap happened before, and honestly, this isn't. But then Chin Chimnel spots something in distance. As Chimel walked briskly towards it, towards it, the walls start closing in. Trap door open, and Chimel fall with several turrets. They fall through Fizzler and die, all die except Seamel, because Chamel is not Torrent. Or is he? But Chamel lands safely, due to the Aperture Science Long Fall Boots trademark, and live. Portal open and Chamel briskly fall into more room. This room with large and full of monitor. All monitors show some scary image. Sign distance say exit. Chamel walk briskly for it but the monitor break shatter, causing loud noise and big scare. Big scare! Chamel carry on and fall into the hole into more room. Okay, this is final. I think we're nearly at the end, boys. All right. Let's uh, follow the signs. I saw the signs. It opened up my mind, I saw the sign, where am I going now? I seem to have got stuck on trauma tree. Yeah, that's better. Um, excuse me? We're back where we were. Okay. Is there a hole in the floor? Do you know what though? Fantastic mapping room. If, if, if that's a hole in the floor and that returns you to that, that point, I'll tell you what, map makers need to learn from you. I tell you. The amount of times I've fallen down bottomless pits and had to redo things over and over again. I could learn a thing or two from you. Uh, okay. Ah, okay. Rogan's trying to trick me. Let's follow the light. I can just about see the grating on the floor. I'm worried that there's going to be another gap. Oh my god, I think I beat Rogan's maze. Falling! Here, rape incoming. I don't know. Do okay. I thought that was. Yeah. Oh my goodness, what was on her eyes? Why did she have black eyes? Oh my god. Oh my god. What did I just see? What did I just witness? I have no idea. Alright, we need to read this. Um, after briskly going through through dark maze and me meeting a glow figure look like Chell. Chell. Not Chamel. Trademark, copyright, registered. Chamel finally reached end. The exit opened and Chamel carry through. Glamdus, give word. This was an office prank. Non-real. But, as Chamel exit elevator, elevator, Cmel die, explode. Oh my god, scary. But was a, was ghost real? Jamel won't find out. <gasps> the end. Or is it? Thank you for letting me help. Helping you write this dude. It was fun. Remember to leak this part before putting it on the workshop. So we didn't lose any, any of our body parts. 
that is a massive relief, I have to say. I really did not want to be dismembered by anything. Rogan, you've done it again. You sexy beast, you have done it again. That gets a favourite from me and a thumbs up, of course. Um, you know, people. a lot of people could learn from you. I like, I like this style of mapping as well. This style of mapping where you walk through and you're telling a story. You've not just mapped it out. You are actually telling a well-written story. It's just fantastic. I wish more people would take this approach. Um, a lot of people could, could learn a lot from you, Rogan. I really think you should be like right up there at the top of the workshop. Every time you go to a workshop, subscribe should be... You could subscribe to this. Maybe you should try Rogan. He knows where it's at. He does, honestly. Guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any match to play, please leave in the comments or head over to my Google form. I'll link that's in the description. But until next time, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Rogan. But it, it promises to be something we've never experienced before. So much so, my express is going cold.